Hello, we're in the artist dressing room area backstage at V Festival at Western and we're here with three of the many that make up Bellowhead. How are you? Good, thank you. Very good. How many actually are there of you in Bellowhead? Uh, there's 11 of us all together in the band. I've got to ask, is this all, sort of a cunning ruse to get on the bigger stages? Uh, no, it's just a way of um, making sure that we never earn much money because we have to split it 11 ways. <laughs> Excellent. Now I heard that you guys have um, previously brewed your own ale. Oh, yeah. yeah, we have. Unfortunately, it's not available here. But yeah, the, the whole brewing process from start to finish, hedonism ale. Yeah, we boring. made it. Yeah. So, it's got what a little it? piece of us in it. <laughs> Is that a good thing? No. <laughs> I was wondering if you had any plans to maybe branch out into wine, like ACDC. We were thinking gin. Yeah, actually. spirits. Gin's the gin's the yeah. way forward. Yeah. We do a tune called Slow Gin, so I don't see why we shouldn't capitalise on that a bit. Mother's Ruin. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so you guys have played some pretty uh, some pretty odd instruments before, and I, I have to uh, I have to quote this. According to uh, the magic of the interweb, uh, a frying pan, a glockenspiel, knives and forks, clockwork toys, megaphone scratching, stomp box, coal scuttle, party blowers, broomsticks, ratchet, Casio VL tone, shakers. And tambourine. Is it, are we missing person. anything? That's just one of the members yeah. of the band plays that lot of crap that he brings with him. <laughs> that lot of crap. And um, we all play, you know, more regular instruments. But he has a lot of. He brings a cool scuttle and knives and forks. Find that things and hit them. Basically, our drummer is someone. He's like a forager, and he forages for things and finds out what they sound like, and then they end up on stage. Is there anything you can't play? Like you can hit anything. <laughs> That's very true. <laughs> uh, so, uh, so eleven of you. Are you all on the one tour bus? Yeah. Yes. Hence, we look a little bit mm. uh, shell shocked Slightly right off. now. Yeah. But you all still love each other. You're not afraid to stand nice and close. No, no, we love each other. We just, yeah, it's difficult in the morning when you get up and you have to look at each other and converse. And I, I believe you're actually the only, the only female <laughs> bellowhead, brave lady. What's it like being on the tour bus with ten blokes? It's it's tricksy. After seven years, I think very little phases you. Yeah. There's very little they, they oh, can on, say. We're lovely. We're lovely. <laughs> we, do, we look after Rachel, don't we? We look we're after like you. We're like big brothers. We're like a family, you know, and families do fall out. <laughs> <laughs> no tension here? None. <laughs> so you. So do you, ever, uh, do you ever get out from backstage and actually go and check out some of the music? No. <laughs> <laughs> Not keeping it real here. It's very easy backstage. The thing about coming to a festival, you always have a great plan of I'm going to go and see all these artists and oh, what a lineup, brilliant. And then you do end up sitting backstage <laughs> and not seeing anything. Well, we've also been, I think it's our 20, well, we're doing 20, 22 festivals this summer. So I think we're a little bit jaded by music generally. And it's quite nice to just sit down and drink coffee and yeah. try and pretend to be normal. Yeah, enough with the music. Excellent. So 22 festivals this summer. What's been the, what's been the highlight besides obviously? V today. Oh, v, V is like the, the highlight of it. We did Green Man last night. That mm. was amazing. Yeah. Really good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we did Glastonbury really in the year and Latitude and quite a few others. I can't remember where we've been. Quite we did Port Elliot, which wasn't, yeah. it's kind of an arts festival more than a music festival, but it was, it was a beautiful great. setting as well, wasn't yeah. it? Right by the estuary and uh, and same with Green Man last night. We were overshadowed by mountains and that was actually quite beautiful. Majestic backdrop to majestic music. Actually, speaking of music, you've got a new album coming out soon, is that correct? No, we Have released, we? Uh, we oh, released just our last out? album in September. Ah, last September. Yeah. Is that the one you described as not for the faint-hearted? I don't... Did, did <laughs> it's, we? it's perhaps not the album for you to buy. There's a lot of dirty, horrible people in that album. Not just the band, but subject matter. <laughs> Care to elaborate? Anyone dirty, horrible people? Well, there are quite a few songs about prostitutes, prostitutes. Um, sailors, drunkards. None of whom are dirty, horrible people, I'd hasten to add. <laughs> We're doing our demographic a disservice. Okay. <laughs> Bit of necrophilia? Yeah, it's all yeah. there is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All good people. Well, you know, the, you know the Saturdays are here. Are you thinking of maybe penning some tunes for them? Bit of, bit of ghost writing? If they wanted us to write songs about necrophilia for them, we were, <laughs> we're, the, we're the go-to guys. Vfestival.com exclusive possible bellowhead and the Saturdays collaboration coming to you soon. <laughs>